हे माय नेम इज हैप्पी आई हेल्प कैंडिडेट्स इन डॉट नेट इंटरव्यू प्रिपरेशन आफ्टर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो यू विल बी एबल टू आंसर दिस क्वेश्चन इन एनी इंटरव्यू इफ यू वॉन्ट टू कवर ऑल द डॉट नेट इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन देन प्लीज क्लिक ऑन लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब बटन सो डैट यू कैन नॉट मिस एनी इंपॉर्टेंट इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद दिस क्वेश्चन वट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन डिलीट ट्रंकेट एंड ड्रॉप कमांड्स this is an important questions and in many interviews this question has been asked sometimes they asked difference between the delete and truncate sometimes truncate and drop sometimes delete and drop but yes uh, you should know what is the difference between all three so let's start with the delete 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 what is delete command delete is a dml uh, just for reminder insert update and delete are dml dml is data manipulation language so when you write queries like insert query update query delete query these are dml's only now these are used to define the uh, what is ddl then uh, ddl is data definition language and it is used to define the table structure like create table drop table so it is related to the table structure coming back to the question delete is a dml second thing is delete is used to delete one or more rows of a table it is that simple and delete command can be rolled back so here is the example of delete delete from employees where employee id equal to 7 that will simply delete the uh rows some rows from the employees table that is delete next is truncate truncate is a ddl so as we have uh, seen that delete is a dml so see delete is a dml because delete uh, create uh, sorry insert update delete these are dmls truncate is like a ddl because it works on the structure of the table it used to delete all rows from the table so you cannot apply a filter like this employee id equal to table 7 uh, it will delete all the rows from the table it can be rolled back like delete then truncate sorry the spelling mistake truncate will remove all the records from the table employee but not the structure schema so that is a important thing about truncate that it will if you will write the truncate command like this truncate table employees so first of all you cannot apply where condition with uh, with this and then it will remove all the data but not the structure like the your columns will be there but not the data then the last one is drop drop is again a ddl like truncate it is used to drop the whole table with a structure and a schema it cannot be rolled back it will remove the structure schema also here you can see this drop statement and see the difference between delete is like delete you can apply the filter but in truncate and drop you cannot apply the filter so this is how delete is different now between truncate and drop in truncate the table structure will not be deleted but in drop table structure will also go away that there will be nothing remaining of a table if you will apply this drop command and drop command cannot be rolled back but truncate you can roll back so these are the differences between delete truncate and drop commands